uh, we'll be bringing modern and contemporary sculptures to the waters of East London. This area of East London is currently undergoing the biggest urban transformation in Europe, um, subject to multi-billion pound investment. Sculpture walk like this, on the line like this, will be for everyone to enjoy. They'll be, a, they'll be able to say that this is something that came out of that wonderful festival we had, and it can live on. What's extraordinary about sculpture, I think, is that our, our lives are increasingly um, massively dominated by screens. Cinema screens, television screens, computer screens. That we're looking at these things all the time. And what's extraordinary about sculpture is that it's a reason to lift your head. Wonderful things on those screens, but there's also wonderful things out there as well. Yeah, there are some great artworks that are just languages, languishing in storage. It is a kind of way of liberating um, works that are unavailable and out of sight for too long. Suddenly, such an obvious and brilliant thing to to be able to do. Definitely be bringing my children down to the river because I'd like to get them more interested in us. I think having the river there yeah, and the artwork allows them to play. Very few people actually realise uh, that uh, Newham has more waterways than Venice. Uh, three of its boundaries are rivers and we have the largest docks in the world. I believe that a lot of people, when they discover this area, will see it in a very different light. The planning, organisation and implementation of this plan cost money.